Hey there, and welcome to another Dave Does video. Today we're doing a reaction to Alfie Rev and Wonderful Indonesia to the sacred Nusantara. Is that correct? Is that the correct pronunciation? Nusantara? I don't know. You let me know in the comments down below. Uh, I've been looking forward to this. I've not watched any of the trailers because I wanted to kind of get a first real impression without getting any kind of previews or anything like that. So that's why I've not checked out any of them before. Uh, but we're going to go check this one out. It's quite a long track, so we'll probably have to do some pause in and stuff just to kind of break it down. I've got the window open because, again, it's still very warm here in the UK. I'll try and move over here so I can do it. But let's, uh, yeah, let's do it. It's a uh, work with CGI and graphics is very good. It blends it very nice. It's very natural. It's not quite realistic, but it's uh, it's not far off as far as like some of the textures. It's almost like AAA video game sort of graphics, which is good. They're cute little creatures, whatever they are. I don't know what they're meant to be, but they look cool. Some sort of tree, tree of life, maybe. It's a nice blend of practical effects and animation. Very nicely done. I had a thought feeling that staff that she's holding was actually uh, animated before, but I guess it was practical. Can't quite tell. Which is very good. Once upon a time, there was a princess who lived in a beautiful land, which everything he loved the stories of peacefully. She spent all her time in the depth of a forest with her eight little friends. There was a hidden secret place so magical and dangerous at the same time. This is the story where the culture had start. And now, let me take you on a journey. So welcome to really Wonderland, cool. Indonesia. The sacred Delicate. Mm. 
vocal line is very rhythmical, which I like. impressed by how much effort and work has gone into this video.
One day, at another time, a girl will unearth the civilization that has been buried. Such a large amount of storytelling. Now, I know this is all the titles, we're going to let this run because it's important to recognise the amount of work, the people involved. Um, so let's make sure we get all that in there. Alfie is obviously a huge, uh, big part of that, it's involved at all levels. Movie theatre, so you all kind of just get up and leave at the end of all these people's hard work that's coming up. Give you a pass to the Don't even play this. Better live. These people did multiple different roles within the production, so it's um, it's amazing how small the team it is that's actually created this. We'll start talking about it because we've got a bit of time there while this is playing, so we've got to leave this up on the screen. But um, yeah, that was really good from Alfie Rev. He's really stepped his game up even more. So, I mean, he was great anyway on what he's done, but he's taken everything he did with um, Wonderful Indonesia, the first one, to take it to a whole new level on the second. Uh, the storytelling was immense. Graphics was amazing. He's really, really done a huge amount. He's like done it as like a triple A, like Hollywood movie style graphics. Um, storytelling was great the whole way through. Good mix of um, the fact the fact that you've got dual um, subtitles in English and uh, Indonesian is great. Uh, really helps someone like me who watches it. Um, the song the songs and the, the music as it transitioned into different parts flowed really naturally. I love the heavy metal rock stuff in there. That was very cool. CG supervisor Alfie Rare. Of course it was. Okay, so there's a, there's quite a big team working on the 3D animation stuff, the simulation stuff. But a lot of them, it seems to be maybe like a five, six man team. Which is good. I just don't know what Alfie's gonna do next. I mean where does it go with it? Quite a lot of dancers as well, wasn't there? I mean, this one felt the, the reason I liked this one a lot was because the storytelling was so strong. And there's a lot of dancers going on there. It just keeps going. <laughs> I didn't even realise there was that many people dancing here. I just thought I, I don't remember that many people. I thought it was like, oh, it was in the stage concert, isn't it? In the concert hall, where he had all those people there. That's why he had so many people dancing. Ricky, Eris, Nido, Restu. Some people just like one name: Ari, Aris, Kevin. <laughs> Kevin. It's just a Kevin there. Okay, fair enough.
quite like that. They, they quite like the transportation. Yeah, the guys driving. Very important guys. They got the shit everywhere. I like the blend of the CGI and the real world. You just really couldn't tell what the CGI was. Obviously, things like the dragons are going to be CGI, but everything else is very difficult to see what was blended and what was real and what was a CGI. So there we go. Wonderful Indonesia 2, the Sacred Nusantara. That was very cool. Um, yeah, I mean, the outro is quite long, but he, I mean, it's important to say thank you to everyone. Uh, so it's actually only about 12, 12 minutes of actual music and it's about five minutes roughly of outro. Um, but yeah, I've, I think I've covered pretty much everything while I was going through it, but it's the, it's the element of, I do apologize about background noise through this video. It's just unfortunately new, new setup of the equipment due to a new computer, uh, and also a little bit of, um, got to have the window open and we've got a storm on its way just to try and clear the air hopefully it's been a bit warm bit muggy um but i really really liked this track it makes me want to go and really break into the history of the story in more detail um it the way the song transitions it really does drive emotion uh, and I really liked that. So, um, yeah, I can't wait to see what he does next. I really I don't understand why he's not doing more, not just music stuff, but like big like film productions and stuff like that, because he's obviously a very talented guy. Um, so I can't wait to see something more from him in the future. Now, if you like this video, please do subscribe, click the bell icon, like, share, leave the comments down below. And that, of course, is how Dave does it.